Are you staring at a no signal screen on your scepter monitor? Don't worry. Today, we'll guide you through the steps to troubleshoot and resolve this issue. Hello everyone. Welcome back to Conscious Guide, where we solve your tech troubles. In this video, we'll tackle the dreaded scepter monitor no signal issue. Let's get started. Before we dive into the solutions, it's important to understand what no signal means. It indicates that the monitor is not receiving a signal from the source, like your PC or gaming console. First, let's start with basic troubleshooting. Check connections. Make sure that the video cable is securely connected to both the monitor and the source device. If it is not you should unplug the cable and let it for a few minutes then replug back securely. Power cycle. Turn off the monitor and the source device. Unplug them for a few minutes, then plug them back in and power them up. Input source. Check if the monitor is set to the correct input source by using the buttons on the monitor to navigate through the menu. If basic troubleshooting didn't work, let's move on to some advanced methods. Check the cable. Test the video cable by using it with another device. If it doesn't work, try replacing the cable. Update drivers. On your PC, make sure your graphics card drivers are updated. You can do this by going to the manufacturer's website or using the device manager on Windows. Monitor settings. Sometimes the issue could be with the monitor settings. Reset the monitor settings to factory default through the on-screen menu. If you've tried everything and still can't resolve the issue, it might be time to seek professional help. Contact Scepter customer support or take the monitor to a professional repair service. They can help diagnose if there's a hardware problem. We hope these steps helped you get back on track. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech tips and tricks. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments below.